So last night was the TGMA, and you all know that when it comes to the Ghana Music Awards, it's full of surprises. Yes, yeah, so some people went home happy, and some people went home with a heavy eye full of tears. <laughs> but which other way? The question is, did you vote? You are saying, say, oh, this person doesn't deserve this award. This person doesn't deserve that award. At the end of the day, did you vote for that person? Are you did you root for that person for that person to come and win? So yes, that's the question that people will ask you when you say say uh, your favorite didn't win award and you are questioning the board that hey I didn't say my award number any pan did you vote? So yes, today I have with me some of the winners of the TGMA that went on last night and you will be looking at this. But in the meantime, if you are new to this and I can subscribe to the channel, like and share. And there are some debates, especially when it comes to the artist of the year and the rapper of the year. We're looking at it in a brief time. So yes, let's just get straight to the point and let's get into business. So, best gospel song of the year went to Nasi. And I don't know the winning year was Asada. Asada, I said, bro, that's one of my favorite gospel songs last year released, man. So, record of the year went to Stoneboy featuring Angelic Kujo. And the, the, the title of the song is Madoji. Yes, a very beautiful song, yeah. And um, Stoneboy also won the album and the EP of the year with Fifth Dimension. Hip life, hip hop song, hip hop, uh, hip life, hip hop artist of the year went to Black Sheriff. And uh, Stoneboy won the reggae dancehall artist. Stoneboy also won the songwriter of the year. Uh, Kwame Eugene won the high life artist of the year. And uh, best gospel artist also went to Nasi. MOG also won the best producer of the year. Charlie, that guy, he really did put in work. Wow, I swear. The video won the best African artist of the year. But when it comes to this kind of award scheme, do they, like the artist where they win the awards, do they actually receive it? So artist now we will we receive that best art best African artist who said then 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 I want they could do a money China because I don't see them talking about it I don't see them posting it on their IG to even thank the board for you know honoring them that kind of award I don't see them talking about it but uh, okay ben ben then I was scheme I must have made the video who are my video is not going to talk about it to even thank the board for you know giving uh, him that kind of award okay. So yeah, yeah, to also Kweku Anansi Amradu, yes, won the best high life song of the year. So this I don't understand. The best high life song of the year was won by Amradu, but the best high life artist of the year became Eugene. This thing, eh, ah, like what's up? Best high life song. The person where he did the best high life song under the year of review went to Amradu. Where the best high life artist is Kwame Eugene. So what's up? Like I can go say the only Engu Koko, Eba Begu Gary Sokins. If you prepare Gary Sokins plus sugar and things, then you go add red oil to it. And fa like you know the tally, but tally. You know why I say we work? Eh, but the na na mudi amasi Engu Koko. You know no why I say we work? Cause it's hard to be a nyan na say. Yeah, yeah, two aswe. So Kofi Kenata won um the best reggae and dancer song of the year with a few kuma love and the best reggae dancer artist of the year is tomboy how do i mean tell you so if kofi kirata can win an award with um a few kuma which happens to be a reggae dancer song then why is he not the winner of the reggae dancer artist of the year you'll be coming to that i'll be explaining this in a brief sadly sometimes i confuse but i'll be explaining it in a brief so yes, uh, Olive the Boy won um, Best Afro B Song with Goosin. Can Promise won the Best Afro Pop Song with Terminator. Can Promise again, now they say winning the Afro Beat Afro Pop Artist. So you see, Can Promise a winning uh, uh, say Terminator song with Afro Pop Song, not as a. And also maybe winning, or not as an artist. You know? So yes, the person deserve it. Artist. And if the same artist won the same category with a song which happens to be an Afro beat and Afro pop. Now, oh, Charlie. Oh, yeah, sometimes, you know, that, that, that requires some people want to withdraw from this award things like that because I come at here, I come at once. I bet I come at once. So, yes, liquor featuring Stone Boy. Um, was the best collaboration of the year, which is won by Kid. Your Kid, the winning is our award, and 
Madoji, right? International collaboration of the year featuring Stoneboy and also Stoneboy in the year. Won the best hip hop song of the year with Winner. Uh, with um, or time, all right? And the best hip hop, hip, uh, hip life artist of the year also beat Stoneboy. Right? And the best hip hop, hip life artist of the year also be a uh, black sheriff. Oh, Charlie. And uh, the uh, one my hand on my last, okay, is uh, Kim Paluta. Yeah, hate remix featuring um, Kwame Eugene won the best hip life song of the year. Kim Paluta, yeah, hate remix and on Suvini and So, yes, this is what we have on the board. Now, who won the best rapper? And the winner is. Dear God, dear God, yeah, Woo. hey, one city shame who and come try to break a man see the media bobo. And the artist of the year also went to Stoneboy. Like what's up? And people are like the best rapper there. Like they could take give lyrical Joe because lyrical Joe at the year the year under review, lyrical Joe did a lot of hard work where he they deserve him. So people will be like, eh, it's a if he say uh GMA yeah, he say strongman a trinity or Ghana music industry they have ne they, they've never given a strongman an award before until I didn't think I'm from a strongman now. You see. When it comes to award that has to do with voting, eh, it be this kind of things we will be happening. Because if the artist they deserve and we you know get much vote, it means they will take the award give them. Say the panel yeah, they will say only pass me the way there. Just because say in fan base are not enough to vote for him. And now in, in fan base not able to vote for him, you know, then they will take the award, give somebody away, he gets plenty votes. So if you are able to buy plenty votes, if you are able to pay a lot of money for people to vote for you, then it means that you go win the award. Whether you deserve it or not, you know, they will take the award give you just because we are able to pay. It's purely business. What did I say? They don't give the award to the people who deserve it. They give the award to the people who are able to vote more or people where, you know, like child people vote for them. Except for when I'm this award in the mamu. And when it comes to the artist of the year, a lot of people were rooting us for uh Kim Promise. Say so, oh Kim Promise, I like him uh, he terminate that song, you know, you know, uh Raki, uh the saying uh, the streaming platform number one. Charlie, the song was everywhere, number one, Shazam, iTunes, Nissan Kunabana didn't so yeah, I didn't tell my former Kim Promise, Stoneboy, hey, that's Stoneboy then oh yeah. Oh Charlie. When it comes to award, when it comes to award that has to do with voting, how do you expect? It's full of surprises when it comes to a war that they be out. We ain't voting money pass me, so we ain't voting money pass me. Yeah, like, 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 what's up? And if y'all don't, if y'all don't was training three days today for the same reason, saying, you say, oh, them take give Sako there twice. So, Stone Boy also won't win them twice when you in TM Pharma can promise. So, if the person deserves it 100 times, like they for not take give them a hot. If the person they deserve them 200 times, they will not take give them because the person has won it so many times and that they should give other people the opportunity to also win their award, even if they don't deserve it. It's, it's, like some people make some anal analysis and when you sit down and listen to them, you'll be like, ah, Jimmy Semben or no, bro. Jimmy Semben or no. Oh. So, Charlie. These are some of the lists that I'm uh, I've able to chance uh, to chance on on Twitter. You can go on Twitter and search for the race. But these are the major ones that uh, everyone will be looking at for. So yes, I decided to make a compilation and bring it to you guys. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Um, do you think said uh, you no know, the awards that were given to the people were well deserving? Do they deserve it? And do you think said uh, the awards that has to do with voting and Gasano? Is this something that we should have a look at it? Which I said, yeah, first a bit maybe be for one and because I know my way hard drink. Which I say because any panel had the impun just because of say oh you have vote in film for you know but say ah na award na slide na koko money pass me see for that was why guru eh na dream say sa GMA award one one award na the no unfan who is in bill so yeah this is twenty two miles can you subscribe to the channel to become part of this beautiful family until then peace out.